Hey guys and girls, welcome to another episode of Mormon's Minecraft. Um, this is new by the way. I made that. It's very nice. Uh, I've, cause I've just gotten tired of trying to find my way down and never being able to find a way. Um, <clears throat> sorry, it's my morning voice. Um, I didn't put up a video on Saturday or Sunday, so I'm trying to get this one up early. Um, <clears throat> so please just excuse me. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I didn't have the cow farm last episode. Uh, I just figured I would enclose them just to make it easier, because they were all over the place. Um, but I think. Oh, shut up. I think it's just getting too small, so if we have enough time in this episode, I want to expand it a little bit. Um, uh, what else did I do? Oh, yeah, this sword. Last episode, I said that that sword would not help against creepers just because it didn't have knockback. And it doesn't really matter. It's got sharpness too. Two shots and a creeper's dead anyway, so... That was stupid of me to say, but, eh, it's good. Um, other than that, I did a couple, f a, little, a couple farming, a little farming, those trees are gone, which is nice, you can actually see now. Um, expanded the reed farm over there. What I want to do this episode first is I want to go over there, that looks really cool maybe plan out where I want my next base to be. So, let's head over there then. Okay, so, big news you guys. I got my first subscriber. But, as far as... <laughs> as far as the whole, um... I only want one subscriber and I'll keep going type thing. Doesn't count. Um, one subscriber, you know who you are, and you know why you don't count. Um, <laughs> but, I, <laughs> just, <sighs> that should not have hurt. And yeah, I guess it didn't, but it sounded like it hurt. This is not why we're here. Dang it, there's just so many caves here. Okay, so... Oh, hold on, excuse me. Ugh, hold it in. Don't sneeze. Okay, I'm good. For now. Yeah, just one... That one harvesting of the trees that I showed you guys last episode took down that much of my unbreaking axe took a while too. I got like almost 10 stacks of trees or er, of wood. Okay, if this was if this like led into a cave, that would be pretty cool. But I think I really want my uh my base to be at the top of the mountains. Hello lag, what is going on? You good? No. I don't know what's going on right now, but it is becoming nighttime. Got it. Okay, I don't know what that was. Oh, it's back. Is this a multiplayer glitch? <laughs> it's really no point to do single player anymore. But I don't really. I don't know. Every time I try to get a server, like you either have to pay for it, which I don't feel like doing since I already paid for the game, or. Um, it's a crappy server, and either the server itself dies or someone ruins your life on it, and it's just not fun. Okay, so let's check this guy out. It looked really big. Ah, look, I have my stopwatch thing open on Google Chrome, and I didn't start it. Ah. <sighs> Man. 
There's some light. Um, I think I've been here. I think I've, that's the direction I came from, from spawn. That looks like a big cave. I remember that thing, yeah. Let's check out this cave. Oh, yeah, another thing that I wanted to do this episode. Ouch. Um, I want to get obsidian for a portal to the nether. Um, there's something in the nether that I want. I don't quite recall what it is right now. But it exists. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, just tired. Gotta prepare for the coming storm, as as one might say. You're not a storm, you're just stupid. Um, today is the first day of school. I need to learn to just kill them. Because they'll die if I just do that. It only takes two hits. Uh, oh! Dang it. <laughs> Don't look at the Enderman. Not ready for an Enderman battle. Uh, guess that wasn't actually a cave. Let's head back home then. Or just find any kind of cave. Now I kind of want this to be a short episode. I don't want to get lost in a cave. I thought there was some surface lava somewhere. It w there was one in the jungle, I remember. Um, or just before it anyway. I don't know if it's worth going out there. But it probably is. Let's go out there then, that way. Alright, so, today I'm going to tell you guys a story. There's some lava, but it's only one source, so that wouldn't get me any obsidian. Um, I'm going to tell you guys about my hero today. <laughs> yeah, whenever you get one of those dumb essays in school, Write about your hero. This is what I write about. Um, I might not have died with this experience, but um, I sure felt like I was going to. Um, so I was at this pool, and um, we got there really early, like nine or ten o'clock. So no one else was there, and. I had never like thought about it like this, but don't blow up. That's bull crap. Freaking lag. Oh my goodness, this lag is ridiculous. What's going on? Seriously, it's never like this. Give me my computer usage. Um, forty, thirty-five ish. Megabyte or uh, percentage allocated memory 53. Ouch! I don't know what's up with that. I haven't done anything besides record some Republic Commando. Oh, yeah, by the way, check out that I made a new series Republic Commando with Mormon Jedi. I think I'm, I've uploaded up to the second video, the second episode right now. Um, definitely check it out. It's a amazing game actually reminds me of like a combination of Halo and Half-Life but um definitely check it out awesome game if you don't have it you should buy it I mean if you like it that is um get this crap out of my out of my screen uh, anyway so we were at the pool and nobody was there and when you know when there's nobody at a pool um, the water level was actually lower. And maybe I just, maybe I had just gotten taller or something like that, and, uh, whoever had told me that the l water level was lower, it was all in my head or something like that, but it sure felt like it was lower, and I've always been kind of a short person. Especially so when I was younger. So, 
so I was I was able to go to the deep end which was amazing oh I don't blow up um like I was just uh, barely able to like bob up and down on my tippy toes um and it was fun you know hanging out oh jeez I'm not looking at you dude anyway it was awesome to uh, be able to play in the deep zone because like oh the legendary you know the shallow zone is the area that was just right for me was so small so I couldn't actually do anything else that it was ridiculous it made me very sad uh, die um so yeah I was in the deep end and I think the jungle's this way I hear that lava um hmm where is it where'd it go I do need some gunpowder so I'm gonna collect these guys as dead bodies oh where's that lava it's gone hmm <laughs> got it whatever um so yeah I was in the deep end it was like 9 or 10 in the morning something like that and I and then like oh crap don't kill me I'm not in the mood to fight you guys then again yes I am stop killing each other um and then like I kid you not two full bus loads of what must have been the nearest city's fat clubs come running into the water okay not I'm not I'm, I don't have anything against fat people but that definitely raised the water level right away and I was I noticed it I was like okay time to go this is not good and so I was trying to make my way back into the shallower end and I was just about to pass the um the, the deep end marker thing when one of the fat people came and pushed me they pushed me back um deeper and I was like oh, no I couldn't swim I guess that would have been helpful information earlier <laughs> I even now I suck at swimming but oh okay yeah, let's go down here whatever um but yeah I couldn't swim worth crap so in the motion of her pushing me back Yes, it was a her. I remember. <laughs> um, found some lava. In the motion of her pushing me back, she pushed me into one of her other fat friends. Who, um... Oh, sorry, I'm not trying to use fat as... A... A hurtful word, or a... Derogatory term, or whatever. Um, just trying to use it as a descriptive word so you guys get the idea that these people are large and I was small and they can very easily push me around as they did um, I really don't need the spotter uh, whatever
Um, is there lava down here? Ooh, that's even better. And emeralds. Wow, there's so many emeralds. Uh, I need water, seriously. Anyway, so, when she pushed me back, I hit her other friend. I mean, I didn't, I didn't hit her, but like, my body ran into her. What the heck? Oh. Um. And the momentum of it all pushed me back again. And then I hit another one of them. And that pushed me back again. Now, I had only been playing, like, in the shallow end of the deep end. So when this happened, I was all out in the middle of the deep end with nowhere to go. Um... And this is the part, maybe I wouldn't have died, but, uh, things definitely would have gone down had it not been for this person. Um, yeah, so I, th I thought I was dying, it was the end of the world, and, you're going the wrong way. Oh, jeez, that could have destroyed my water source. Um. I was trying my best to swim, trying my best. I couldn't quite do it though, because uh, I don't remember exactly if the fat people were like pushing me back further, or, like laughing at me or something. It felt like that it was on purpose. And I mean, I, I don't want to insinuate that they were doing it on purpose. It could have been an accident completely. But, nevertheless, I was getting quite, um, tired, and I was about to give up. When all of a sudden, out of nowhere comes my older sister. Oh, excuse me, she must have been watching me or something. She, like, dives in the water, grabs me, and... And she pulls me to safety. She saved my life, probably. Um, she could have saved my life. I don't know. Um, but that was one of the close, the nearest to death moments that I've had. And my older sister saved my life. I think. She's my hero. <laughs> I just broke you. Are you serious? Uh ho, ho I have that on video too. What the heck? It, but they fixed that glitch. What the I am going to have to contact Mojang about this. Oh my goodness, how am I supposed to get this obsidian? This is good, right? I'm not gonna die from this. Dang it. Okay. Um. So yeah, she saved me. And I didn't go back in the water all day. Because I hate when bus loads of people go anywhere. Let's admit it. When they come to McDonald's. Um, that's when... When they come to McDonald's without telling us. Even when they do tell us. It's annoying as crap because they usually come at like 9 or 10 at night when you just sent everybody home that was staying for dinner. So it's like you're dealing with the night people and there's not too many of them. When you get a busload of people, it's like terrible. Absolutely terrible because you're not prepared for it. Um, I mean, I guess it's the same with any other place, except for, like, amusement parks. They should be expecting busloads of people. But, pool, it's like, then there's all those people that know each other, and when they know each other, they, like, are more likely to be jerks. 
making a generalization there. Um, but you know what I mean. Um, when there's big groups of people, they're more likely to um, get in the way, for one thing, and also threaten to kill a person by drowning them in the deep end. That's just my personal experience with buses. I'm sure that there's many people that have been a part of those buses that would like to say otherwise. Um, and I, I'm not trying to stereotype all of the people, all of the those people that have been part of the buses. Um, I'm just making a generalization here. Uh, I do need a bucket of... I need my water back. That's what I need. And you know what? I have another bucket now. I might as well get some lava. Because I have an idea. Okay. Um, wow, more emerald. That's great. What level am I on? Ah, uh, level 14. That's perfect caving conditions. Um. You will die. You're dead. You are dead. And I am the one who killed you. I don't have any coal. Um. Dang it, I think I'm gonna make my way back up. And I will be right back with you guys. That button. Check it out. I found the jungle as soon as I came out of that hole. Oh man, what a waste. Whatever. Um, pretty sure home is this way. Uh, I think once I get home, I'm gonna call it an episode. I think it's been pretty close to half an hour now and I need to get ready for school um, again guys I don't think I'm gonna make too much of a what's this light? Is that lava? yeah I don't think I'm gonna make too much of a habit of getting up this early oh, I'll, be up, I'll have to get up earlier than this anyway so I can go to seminary. I usually get up at 5 for that. In order for me to have enough time to make an episode and to render it and stuff, I'm going to need at least an hour. So, um, I'm probably just going to start uploading them at like 2 in the morning. Um, 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 um where is home? Where are you home? So far away. I need to go this way. And... This way. Yeah, that, that's the way. I saved a screenshot, dang it. Oh my goodness. So apparently I can't change my thumbnails to be like episode... Thumbnails. <laughs> I'm... Unless I like... That can't be right. Ugh. Oh, I'm looking at my Z, not my X. X needs to go down. Z needs to go down. Or, well, up, technically. What the heck is happening? This way. This is the way. Okay. Um. What was I saying? Yeah, I won't be able to keep this schedule up for too long. And once seminary starts, especially, um, that will be in about a week. Ugh. Life, you guys. Life. Yeah, this is the way. Stop it. Stop it. Dang it. Hmm. Maybe I'll get an enchantment in. What do you think? 
What do I need to enchant, though? I don't have any diamonds left. I'm gonna have to go caving soon. Uh, dang it. Like, legit caving. Like, I just went caving for... There's my reed farm. <clears throat> hey, guys. Stop killing each other. Um, I just went caving for lava. And even then, I didn't really go caving. So, next episode might be a caving episode, but... That usually tends to go pretty long. Sorry, I don't mean to uh, say that I want to make a short episode and rip you guys off. My one subscriber. Um, but... Er, I'd expect longer videos on the weekends. If that even, because... Uh, I work, and then on Saturdays I'm going to be working two jobs. And... I need to keep up with people as well. I did expand that too. It goes all the way back there. I don't know if I showed you guys that or not. Um, great time to end the episode. Um, I think I'm gonna go to sleep and call it an episode. I couldn't make an enchantment, but I don't know what I'd enchant. I just repaired this sword. Beautiful sharpness too. I could use a better pickaxe, but I don't have any diamonds. Oh, my armor is enchanted. How's that doing? It's doing good. I haven't gone caving with it yet. Legitimate caving, anyway. Um, oh, man, here we go. It's rain. I'm thinking about lowering my game sounds in general because I've been watching some other let's players and they usually have the game sounds lower than what I do I put these emerald blocks up here just because I can looks like I can get no I'm one short okay um I guess I'll show you guys how my storage thing is set up this is useful junk because of the crafting tables. This is wood. A bunch of wood from that. Um, I think I have some gravel. Nope. That's gravel. And since gravel is just crap, I also have the crap in here. Uh, I already went in there. This is grass blocks. Stone materials and whatnot. Cobblestone. I think we're going to make our um, nether portal next episode, you guys. Thanks for watching. As always, feel free to like and subscribe. Ooh. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> and leave a comment if you are feeling like leaving a comment. Thanks for watching, you guys. I'll see you next time.